So this week, NVIDIA and OpenAI have gone into a huge $100 billion business deal where NVIDIA is actually investing into OpenAI for part equity uh, to spin up 10 gigawatts of uh, compute. So this is uh, obscene amounts. Just to give you an idea of scale, Elon Musk's or XAI's Colossus 2, the, the new huge biggest one on earth, is just over one gigawatt of compute. So this is, you know, millions of GPUs, of Blackwell GPUs. What do you think of that? That's just col yeah, colossus. So that's huge. Yeah. It's not all <laughs> going to be in the one spot. Um, it's fair to say that it's going to be in multiple plants across the world, mostly US-centered. Um, um, but like I sort of find the, and the um, a narrative that the huge investment one I think it's going to be very complex because they will be donating GPUs or they'll be taking reduced margin in return for equity in IT is servers can have a lifespan of three years to five years, which means that you've got to spend a significant amount of that money on these GPUs that are going to uh, basically be obsolete in you know two to three years. So you've got to return your investment, which sort of tells us in this industry what uh, these guys think there's going to be the return on their investment. Yeah, that's the interesting thing because Nvidia up till now has been known as being like the shovels in the uh, in the AI race, right? That you know if you if there's a gold rush, invest in shovels. So everyone's investing in GPUs, meaning that they're going to be the platform that the intelligence is run on. But the fact that they're actually buying into one of the frontier labs who actually build the intelligence itself shows you that maybe they're diversifying a bit because they're thinking. You know, maybe this is, uh, you know, long term, once all the GPUs are out in the entire world is, you know, plated in com computonium, whatever it's called, computonium, um, mm -hmm. you know, there's there's no more GPUs needed. So you've got to get in on the actual uh, inference runtime of, of the world actually running on this. But they're not um, pulling away from Microsoft or Oracle, who historically have been giving them most of their compute platform, right? Um, and I, I just looked it up, uh, Stargate which, you know, up till now is, is the largest, uh, what, compute project in history, the Manhattan Project, uh, is about the same size, about 10 gigawatts. Yeah, and I remember when the first story came out and people were scoffing and laughing at him at the, at the actual scale because he mentioned a number uh, that was, you know, 10x the size of any uh, compute platform on the planet at the time and everybody in the industry goes, oh, he's dreaming, but it's... It's coming to fruition now, isn't it? 